こんにちは、みなさん。今日、私たちは、日本語を勉強しています。質問があれば、聞いてください。Greetings, everyone. Today we are studying Japanese. If you have any questions, then feel free to ask me at any time. We're continuing with Anki. もしかしたらもしかしたらもしかしたら来年 something になるかもしれない。もしかしたらもしかしたら来年転勤になるかもしれないもしかしたらもしかしたら来年転勤になるかも,かもしれないもしかし,かしたら来年転勤になるかもしれない知らないなる転勤来年、okay. もし、then し,したら、so let's see, okay, ten keen is, Job transfer, job relocation, intra company transfer. Let's see, and that kanji comes from revolve, turn around, change. Let's see, what word is that used in? Uh, kurui, turning around once, adverb. Chi ten ten, moving from place to place, being passed around repeatedly. Tenkin, job transfer. Oh, kurobu, to fall down, to fall over. In translative, okay. Kuro garu, to roll, to tumble. Kuro gasu, to roll a wheel. Kenjiru, to turn, to shift. Okay, so that's the first kanji. This Second kanji has to deal with Suto Meru to work for, to be employed for, transitive. Suto Me, service, duty, business, responsibility, tasks. Kinmu, okay. What else? Suto Maru, intransitive, to be fit for a role, to be qualified for. I'll let you use a slightly different kanji though. Uh, Isoshimu, to work hard at.
So basically, to work for plus to to be moved or to to turn means being transferred. So in other words, you're tr you're t you're moving what who you work for. Hence the kanji behind it. Tenkin. She Moshi was if in the case of and then Moshi Ka perhaps oh yeah okay Moshi Ka sh Shitara is perhaps maybe. Moshikashite, perhaps, possibly. See, this translation says it's possible that I might be true. Okay. And let's see the difference between Moshikashi Tara and see Moshikashi Shite versus Mosh Moshikashi Tara. Unaji emi da kero or same meaning but something wa hanashi let's see conversation quote hanashi quote about this what is this word kosha the latter Made from back and someone, some person, okay. Something, I guess, in this case. Kosho wa hanashi kotoba desu. But one's a conversational word? Is that what they're trying to say? Mm -hmm. The latter is a spoken language, so yes, a conversational word. Oh, so they don't even use the other one outside of spoken language. So, Moshikashite is used in a uh, written language, and Moshikashitara is used in spoken language? Let's see. What are you saying about... Okay, so I'm not saying this. There's a slight usage difference. Let's see. Let's see, Moshikashite is more used when you confirm with someone your assumption that you're pretty sure is correct. Moshikashitara is more used when you're simply showing your assumption that you are not sure is correct. Ah, okay, so that's the difference. Mm -hmm. And that sort of makes sense because shitara is the conditional tara form. 
while shite is just the uh, action form or imperative form. Hmm. Okay, so Moshikashitara Rainen Tinki ni Naru Ka Naru Kamo Shiranai. So it's so it's possible that uh, I might be transferred next year. In other words, it's possibility. Uh, uh, will I be transferred next year? I don't. I don't know. So in other words, I don't know if if will I be transferred next year. It's a possibility. Mm. So moshi kashitara moshi kashitara rainen tenkin ni naru ka moshi naru ka mo shiranai moshi moshi kashitara rainen tenkin ni naru ka mo Shiranai. Uh, Eru. Kare wa... Taikin o uh, emashita. Yeah, emashita yo. Kare wa taikin o emashita yo. Eru, kare wa taikin o emashita yo. Eru, kare wa taikin o emashita yo. Emashita, taikin kare, eru. Uh, this conjugation actually gave away what what the sound in here was. Uh, Notice how they just drop the ru and add masta. You only do that for ichidan verbs or iru eru verbs. Uh, so you knew the sound had to either be, have an e on the end or an e on the end. Or an i or an e essentially.彼は大金を得ましたよ。彼は大金を得ましたよ。はじめ、私たちの旅は、はじめは良かったんだ。はじめ、私たちの旅は、はじめは良かったんだ、良かったん。はじめ、旅、旅、え、私たち。あ、彼は結果に。あ、成功、いや、成功したようです。彼は結果に成功したようです。満足。彼は結果に満足したようです。満足。What oh. okay. is seiko then? Seiko. Oh, success achievement. Ma okay. Manzoku. Satisfaction. Manzoku. 
Let's see, this kanji comes from... Oh, full, full fullness enough satisfy. So basically, full and basically full and sufficient, essentially. So full of sufficiency, or in other words, satisfaction. Manzoku. 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 Karewa kekka ni manzoku shita yo Karewa,結果に満足したようです。満足。彼は結果に満足したようです。彼は結果に満足したようです。He seems to be satisfied with results. Watasu? No, no, I... Not Watasu, but, uh... Oh, itasu. Oh. Watashi kara gorenaku itashimasu. Oh, watashi kara gorenaku itashimasu. Itasu. Watashi kara gorenaku itashimasu. Itasu. Watakushi kara gorenaku itashimasu. Oh, to do, that's right. Itash, itasu, to do. Itashimasu. Okay. Gorenaku. Okay. Watakushi. あ、さ、関戦。次、彼らは、あ、彼らは、ぶ、次の試合のために、あ、関戦を立てたのよ。作戦。彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。作戦。関戦 even a word. 関戦 <laughs> Surprisingly, yes it is. 関戦 ship registry. Sakusen. 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 彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。作戦、彼は、あ、彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。立てた作戦試合過ぎ彼ら。彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。作戦試合過ぎ彼らもう一度予約をあ書く
確認。もう一度予約を確認した。もう一度予約を確認した。確認。もう一度予約を確認した。確認。もう一度予約を確認した。確認。予約。どう一も。This grammar. What does this comma here do for the sentence? Mo ichi do. Oh, I think it's just a pause. Hmm, I wonder if there's more to it than that, though. The purpose of commas in Japanese. Okay, the symbol blah is called the doten. It is used to denote a semantic separation or a pause. Compared to comma in English, the usage Of doten in Japanese is less governed by grammatical rules. In other words, in Japanese, the author is free to use or not use、uh, doten in any place where a separation makes sense. When two nouns are placed side by side without a particle,、uh, doten is almost necessary. See, in the Let's see, Ringo o Orange to, to Banana wouldn't work, but it's okay if you do Ringo Orange Banana with commas, okay. O Ringo Orange Matawa Banana. Wait. Mata, is that the right word?、Hmm. It wasn't until 1946 to the period Maru was introduced because Imperial Meiji read foreign works and thought it would be a good idea. Right, so, has it come a recent invention in Japanese or recent use? In Japanese, commas are primarily used to separate clauses or items in a list. Some key uses are items in a list. Let's see. I ate an apple, a banana, and an orange. So, Atashi wa. Oh, that's actually not Ringo, but something else. Oh, wait. That's the kanji for Ringo? I've never seen that before. Uh, Watashi wa Ringo banana soshite mikan o tabemasta. Where's mikan? 
Oh, Mandarin. That's in a Mandarin orange. Usually the Satsutsama Mandarin, when they say Mandarin, when they say Minkan. So it's you. Okay. So it's used in the list. Okay. Separating clauses within a sentence. Let's see. Watashi wa gakko ni iki. Tomarachi to usonda. I went to school and played with my friend. Oh, I see. Uh, if you wanted to write this without, uh, without uh commas you'd have to say something like watashi wa gakusei ni ite tomodachi to osonda and you basically have to use the connecting form but here they change ite with iki so they change it from the connecting te form to the uh noun form iki and then they put a comma there So in other words, it's used for list. It's basically used in places that you would use the connecting tab form from what it seems like. And merging sentences together. See, separating decent, separating dependent clauses from the main clause. Ame ga futte iru tame. Uh, See, I'm making a food day you do tame. Uh, guy, guy, shusuru, guy, shusuru. No, guy, shoot, susuru, guy, shoot, susuru. Okay, which is going out. It's literally the kanji for it, for a uh, uh, exit, like leaving and outside put together. Gai shutsu is the shutsu is the word, and then we just have sudo after it because it's a sudo verb, or now aka a noun. So, gai shutsu gai shutsu sudo. So I make a fute iru. Tame gai shutsu suru no wa hi kae masho and that translates to it's raining so do not go out. So, ame ga fute iru tame. Tame is how you say something that's for the benefit of something. It's translate. It's a noun meaning. Let's see. A good advantage, benefit, welfare. I notice they seem to only have nouns in front of commas. That's sort of like a lot of their part uh, logical particles, where they they only put nouns in front of them. Let's see, safe purpose, good advantage. Hikaeru, to be tempered, to reframe, to abstain, to hold back. So, Gai Shutsu Sudo no wa Hikae Masho, basically suggesting to. Reframe from going out, essentially. So 
So what do they describe? This is separating dependent clauses from the main clause. Since it's raining, let's avoid going out. Tommy is used to, to imply a sense. Interesting. Okay, so Tommy can also mean affecting, regarding, concerning. Okay, so in other words, concerning the fact that it's raining, uh, don't don't go out. Actually, they don't say don't go out. They say. We frame from going out. Not interesting. You can use Tame like that. Oh, Konnichiwa, level 1 alt. Genki desu ka? Let's see. This game is harder than Dark Souls. <laughs> I don't know, there's just so, so many more rules in this game than Dark Souls. Yeah, I'm reading up on the uses of commas in Japanese, which I think is a more recent thing in uh, Japanese. From the, what someone was implying. Let's see, fourth use of commas, separating adjectives or adverbs, modifying the same noun. That's okina akaka. Let's see, okay. Let's see, Okina Akai Ringo? Um, or a large red apple. Basically, the same use pulled from English, and then separating dialogue tags from quoted speech. Kyo wa atsui desu ne to kare wa to kare wa ita. It's hot today, he said. So summing up, it's used for lit making lists like in English, separation between items. It's used to separate uh, clauses that, that you can often are connected with a uh, form chaining. And when you do it, you seem to, instead of having the verb in the te form, you... Uh, uh, put put the verb in the noun form. Let's see. It's used for dependent clauses, so... And it's used for a list... A list in front of nouns, not just a list of nouns. For example, the first list was like a list of nouns being eaten. So they weren't like describing anything. The other thing was it was a list of adjectives uh, describing a, a noun. So it's used for that. And the last thing is it's used to quote something. Though so someone that's those are common uses of it. Uses of it. Though someone else implied that uh, because of how new of an invention it is that people seem to use it how they want. <laughs> See, did Japanese always use a version of commas and periods? Or did it disappear after contact with Europeans? See, those are, in fact, an, ad an adoption from Western language as the Japanese quote bracket blah. Oh, as is the Japanese quote bracket. bracket. The way Japanese was traditionally written uh, in vertical columns going from right to left, the sentence naturally ended after... However many columns uh, it needed, leaving blank 
space for the rest of the line. And then a new sentence would begin from the, the next top of next. There is, there were no spaces between words and breaks be, between clauses had to largely be inferred. Oh, that's interesting. When writing vertically, after you finish a sentence, no matter how much space you have left on the page, uh, you have to go to the top for, to start the next sentence. See, most Japanese punctuation marks were picked up during the Meiji period in the interest of making things more easily organized for print formats such as newspapers, where there simply wasn't the space to allow for for the standard, the quote bracket were the last to arrive. I've read books as recent as 1930s where they really could have used quotes because d differentiating dialogue can be a real pain. Oh, wow. Even in the 1930s, they didn't really have quotes. See, hist historically, kanji and their use in calligraphy by famous calligraphers. I started with kanji and their use in calligraphy by famous calligraphers. Okay. There were sometimes spaces left or a flourish or two. I remember seeing, but not any punctuation used in Western writing. The two writing systems are radically different, so punctuations didn't really develop in Japan or China. With modern typing, I've often seen Western style punctuations with commas and similar markings. Not so much in handwritten samples because Japanese can be written in almost any direction as necessary. Uh, we see the same rudiments of that when reading Western style uh, Marvel or DC comic books in English. I'm not certain to what degree handwriting or calligraphy present presently, but I've seen printed articles make use of punctuations even though the characters are understood for the basics of words, clay, classes, and the meanings as read do not rely as much on punctuations for meanings as a result. Normally commas are optional in Japanese. They are so sometimes useful, but not in the same cases they would be used in English. Uh, in particular, there are not generally used when combining two sentences. For example, in English, you might write, I went to the bank and then went home. In Japanese, you would write, Ginko ni ite kara uh, ie ni uh, ok 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 let's see. Okar, okai, let's see, okairi, okairu. No, I think this is supposed to be, oh, modoru, yeah, modota. Let's see, let me double check that. Wait, that's strange. Kaeru? Why is it being conjugated like a... Oh, that's interesting. Kaeru. Okay, here's an example for you. Uh, Kaeru is a word that looks like an Ichidan verb, but it's actually a Godan verb. It's one of the few words ending with iru or an eru that, uh, is actually a godon verb and not an ichidon verb. So it's kaeta, okay, because of the conjugation. Okay, so ginko ni ite kara ie ni kaeta normally. You would not be tempted to use a comma, although some people might. The more common use of commas is 
is to set off is to set up a topic phrase at the beginning of a sentence like Amega by am Amega no Ame no by uh something ni naru Oh by that's right case situation by Ame no bai, so in case of rain, chushi ni naru. See, chushi, interruption, discontinuance, suspension, stoppage, cancellation. It's a noun pseudo verb. In other words, uh, if it rains, it, be, uh, it, it becomes cancelled. Ame no bai. Chushi ni naru. If it rains, it will be cancelled. Uh, in this case, a comma is required. Another way to use the wa. Another way is to use the wa instead. But if you're trying to write down what someone actually said, you need the comma because many people don't say wa in that case. Japanese Wikipedia gives other cases where commas are required to prevent ambiguity. Okay, that was interesting. That when I see your frog, it reminds me of Wu Tang logo from distance. Fro what frog? What frog are you talking about? I know with the word uh, kairu, uh, I remember uh, it because that's also how you say frog in Japanese, kairu. Oh, you mean, oh, you mean that frog. Oh, okay. I know what you're talking about. Um, yeah, that, that, that's, that frog is a social media platform logo. Uh, their logo is basically a frog, and I just found someone, a frog that looks logo-ish. Okay, you're talking about that one. Yeah, that's a social media platform's logo. Let's see, when I see your frog, it reminds me of the Wu-Tang logo from distance. Yeah, it's on that pl platform, I, I post in advance when I'll be doing streams so that you can follow me and you can um basically know, uh, like, usually around 20 or 30 minutes before I'm going to be streaming. And I tell you a rough estimate of the time I'm going to be streaming. Yeah, okay, let me show you the logo again, yeah. If you go to the link... You can um, basically uh, see the uh, service it is. Yeah, these are all the uh, logos of these different groups. See, yeah, it was by your name, so I assumed it was your frog. And then I look up and it was gone. Oh, yeah. Uh, konnichiwa, uh, blue friend. Genki desu ka? Let's see. Konnichiwa, o genki desu ka? Yeah. Watashi wa genki desu. Yeah, okay. This, uh, serv the service, uh, you see in the URL, that's the service that has the frog logo. I just picked a frog because I know their logo is a frog. I couldn't find their exact frog, so I just picked a frog-looking logo. And yeah, what I was saying earlier is, uh, yeah, on this uh, social media platform, I 
post in, in advance when I'm going to be streaming, usually around 20 to 30 minutes before I stream. So you can see uh, when I'm going to stream in advance. So if you follow me, you can get the notifications. But anyway, you were saying, when I see, see your frog, it reminds me of the Wu-Tang logo from dis, from distant. Wu-Tang. Let me look at Wu-Tang. I've not heard of that logo. Oh, are you, are you talking about just because of the fact that it's a, uh, I see, a, basically a round, a rounded structure with, and where the d dark is and the, in this fog, it's a, nothing's there on the Wu-Tang logo. Yeah, by the, by the way, these are all the platforms I'm on if you want to follow me on them. Okay, anyway, let's get back to this stream. If you need to see it again, just ask me and I can show it to you again. So, so in this case, I would say this use of a comma is hmm. I wouldn't really say that this is a clause in the sense of that the other examples were used, but let's see, Moichido Yoyaku wa Kakunin shita. Kakunin shita, yoyaku, ichido, mo, kakunin. Ba. Kono ba wa, su, uh, kono ba wa, sugu, yoku, naru desho. Oh, wait, no, that's right, that's not ba, that is, uh, chi. Uh, kono chi wa, sugu, yoku, naru desho. Kizu. Kono oh. kizu wa sugu yoku naru desho. Okay, okay, kizu, that's right. Kizu. 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 Uh, kono kizu wa sugu yoku naru desho. Kizu. Kono kizu wa sugu yoku naru desho. Kono kizu wa sugu yoku naru desho. Desho naru yoku kizu. Mo Moshikashitara Moshikashitara So Moshikashitara Rainen Tenkin ni uh, Naru Kamo Shiranai Moshikashitara Rainen Okay Moshikashitara Rainen uh, Tenkin ni Tenkin was um Oh yeah, that's right. Transfer, like a job transfer. See, so Moshikashitara Rainen Tenki ni Naru Kamo Shiranai. Moshikashitara 
もしかしたら来年転勤になるかもしれないもしかしたらあもしかしたら来年転勤になるかもしれない And I, and I believe the reason there's no particle here after the r a i n i n is because、uh, relative、uh, in Japanese, just like in English,、uh, relative, relative uh, time references do not have、uh, anything that they need, need around them, like any kind of marking or particles. But things that are not relative, that are time references, do have a marking around them. So, r i n e n is a relative one next year. So, もしかしたら、来年、天気になるかもしれない。知らない。私、なる、天気。来年、もしかしたら。彼は結果に満足。Okay. 彼,は彼は結果に満足したよう,、ね、ようです。Okay. 彼は結果に満足したようです。満足。彼は結果に満足したようです。満足。彼は結果に満足したようです。満足、結果、彼、した。彼は結果に満足したようです。満足。私からご連絡いたします。い,いたす。私からご連絡いたします。Probably your only hint that this is supposed to be w a t a k u s h i instead of watashi is the fact that they're using the verb いたします、which is a lot more polite than suru or shimasu. いたす。私からご連絡いたします。いたす。私からご連絡いたします。私からご連絡いたします。私からご連絡いたします。いたします。ご連絡。私。成績彼らは次の試合の彼らは次の試合のために成績を立て,立てたのよ成績彼らは次の試合のために成績セクを立てたのよう作戦彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。Okay, so it's not say seku. What is, is say seku even a word? Say seku. Say seku. No, it's not. Okay. Sakusen. 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 
作戦彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ立てた作戦試合過ぎ彼ら So, Kono Kizuwa, uh, okay, Kono Kizuwa, Sugu Yoku Naru de Sho Kizu Kono Kizuwa, Sugu Yoku Naru de Sho. Just remember something Kiru is to cut. So maybe that's how you can remember the key in Kizu. It's from the same key. In, it's like the key in Kiru. Wait a moment. Kizu. If you were to do that adverbial transformation you see with、uh, some Jap Japanese words where they turn verbs into an adverb. Let's see, Kiru. It oh, Kiru is a godon. Hmm. Oh, that's another example of a word that looks like an ichidon verb, but it's actually a godon verb. Kiru. So, この傷はすぐ良くなるでしょう。作戦。彼らはすぐの試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。作戦。彼らは次の試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。And if in case you're wondering why this no is here, I believe this is、uh, that m、mm, you see at the end of sentences in certain cases.、Uh, in this case, you're, you're trying to, I guess, give information or something, which is one of the reasons for it. Or like trying to make a point. You're not just saying something. I think that's how I understand it. So, karera wa. すぐの試合のために作戦を立てたのよ。立てた作戦、okay. 試合、すぐ、彼ら。もし,もしかしたら、もしかしたら、来年、転勤になるかもしれない。もしかしたら。I guess you could think of this as like if you do the possibility or it's possible, in other words. Why もしかしてはもしかしてはもしかしてはもしかしたら、来年、もしかしたら、来年、転勤になるかもしれない。もしかしたら、もしかしたら、来年、転勤になるかもしれない。もしかしたら、もしかしたら、来年、転勤になるかもしれない。
Is this is from Shiredu, I think. To become known. To be known, to be understood. I don't know. I think this was supposed to be the potential form. Yeah, she and I are not possible to know. So it's possible that I might be transferred next year. Konnichiwa uh, Amplifier. Uh, Genki desu ka? Let's see, uh... Tanin. Watashi wa tanin ni... Ju uh, Jusho o oshiete kunai. I forgot to ask about that kunai again. Let's see, uh, let's see. Watashi wa... But for some reason, kunai negates the sentence. So, watashi wa... Uh, watashi wa tani ni jusho o shieta kunai, or... As for I... My address, teaching my address to other people, don't. Tanin, watashi wa tanin ni jusho o shietaku nai. Tanin, watashi, watashi wa tanin ni jusho o shietaku nai. Oh, oh, I don't want to tell other people. Okay, that makes a little more sense. Um. Because obviously the Watashi has to be doing the action, so I don't want to tell other people my address. So, Watashi wa tani ni jusho o oshieta kunai. Oshieta jusho tani watashi. See, amplifier wa uh, genki desu to imashita. Uh, watashi mo? See, so, kare wa uh, grupu, okay, kare wa grupu kara Nakeru? Let's see. Nakemashita. Kare wa grupu kara nakemashita. Nukeru. Kare wa grupu kara nukemashita. Oh, nuke, nuke ma, mashita. Nukeru. 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 Kare wa grupu kara nukemashita. Kare wa grupu kara nukemashita. Nukemashita group kare. Kare wa group kara nukemashita. Kare wa group kara nukemashita. Kare wa group kara nukemashita. Sakusen. Kare ra. Kare ra wa sugi no shiai no tame ni sakusen o tateta no yo. Sakusen, kare ra wa sugi no shiai no tame ni sakusen o tateta no yo. Sakusen, okay, so kare ra wa sugi no shiai no tame ni sakusen o tateta no yo. Tateta, sakusen, tame, shiai, sugi, kare ra. 
他人，我他是我他人，我他是我他人，你举手教えたくない。他人，我他是我他人，你举手教えたくない。他人，啊，我他是我他人，你举手教えたくない。教えた，举手，他人，我他是。Kunai at the end of of a sentence. Let's see if I can find anything today on it. What does it mean if you put? What does it mean if when you I mean when an adjective at the end of a sentence ends with kute? When kute is used at the end of a sentence like this, it is meant to simply imply that there is there is more not being said, or the the thought. Isn't complete like a verbal lisp ellipsis. Okay, it is not a verbal ellipsis, but if you listen to the tone, probably it. But if you listen, the tone probably is. They probably drag the sound out a little and drop off the tone towards the end. The te form of everything can act as a reason type explanation or series of events. So it's this is. Just leaving off the last bit. Let's see. I thought like "kute" was the "kute." Thought it came from "kudu." Oh, that's "kite." Or not "kudu," but uh, "kude mas." Yeah, "kure," "kureru." Oh, that's not ku. That's not kute. That's kude. Wait. Uh, negative te for form of kudu is kure na kute. Hmm. Oh, that's right. Because uh, "nai" is an adjective, and so when you conjugate it in connecting form, "nai" becomes "nakute." That's right. But this right here, "kunai." Not sure.
adding kunai to ja yeah to Japanese adjectives that makes sense but this isn't being added to an adjective. Okay, I have to look this up later. Okay, so continuing. So, watashi wa tani ni jūsho o oshieta kunai. I don't want to tell the people my address. Oshieta jūsho tani watashi kunai. Nukeru Karewa Group Kara Nukemasta Nukeru Karewa Group Kara Nukemasta Nukeru Karewa Group Kara Nukemasta Nukemasta A Group Kare Karewa Group Kara Nukemasta Karewa Group Kara Nukemasta Nukeru Hoka, hoka ni, okay. Hoka ni gochu mon wa. Hoka ni gochu mon wa. Kohi o onigai shimasu. Oka ni, oka ni gochu mon wa. Kohi o onigai shimasu. Hoka, okay. Hoka ni, okay. Hoka ni gochu mon wa. Kohi o onigai shimasu. Onigai shimasu. Kohi, hoka, gochu mon. I suspect this is shorthand for uh Hoka ni go chumon wa arimaska Hoka ni go chumon wa arimaska or another order exist Sui uh Kaigi chu sui Akubi Akubi o Shiteshimaimashita. So during the meeting, so, so, Kai Kai Gichu Sui Akubi o Shiteshimaimashita. Akubi. Hmm. Tsui. Sui, inadvertently, carelessly. I suspect it's another adverb. Adverb, just now, quite near, unintentionally, subconsciously, by mistake, against one's better judgment. Adverb, fukushi. So, kaigi, kaigi chu sui akubi o shite shimaimashita. O oh, akubi yon. Oh, so akubi must be a noun, sudo verb. Akubi. Yes, it is. So, kaigi, kaigi chu sui akubi o shite shimaimashita. Shimaimashita shite akubi tsui kaigi chu. Uru, kare wa ie o utta. Uru, kare wa ie o utta. Uru, okay. Kare wa ie o utta. Utta, ie, kare. I, a, あの人はいい人です。いい。
あの人はいい人です。人、いい人。現在、あ、現在の、キ、キーロー、キヨン、キヨンですよ、私。現在のキヨンは三十度です。現在の気温は三十度です。現在、現在の気温は三十度です。現在、現在の気温は三十度です。どう、三十、okay. 気温、現在。I remember this、uh, own from、uh, onsen or hot spring. And keys use l o t I always pronounce this key in a word. I remember this skin from Genjitsu or、uh, Reality. And then I remember this Zai from、um, Son Zai, which is like existence. Let's see, Son Zai. Existence, being, presence, yeah. So, Genzai no Kion wa Sanju do des, or the, pre-、uh, the present temperature is 30 degrees. Sui, Kaigi chu, Sui, Akubi o shite shimai masta. Sui, Kaigi chu, Sui, Akubi o shite shimai masta. Sui. かい会議中、つい、あくびをしてしまいました。しまいました。して、あくび。すい、会議中彼女が僕の手を握りむ or something? つかむ。彼女が僕の手をつかみました。Yeah, I was thinking about the word 握る。See, 握る。Which is to clasp, to grasp, to clutch, to grip. This is scamu, grip, grab. See, scamu versus nigiru. Scamu versus nigiru. I think nigiru is implied a light gr- grab. So、what's the difference between Skameru, Skamu, and Nigiru? I guess this is a good question. Skamu means hold. Nigiru holds stronger with more power. Interesting, that's not how it was implied. <laughs> See, Skameru means can grip. Can grab a hole. Oh, yes. Skameru is just the potential form of skumu.
Let's see. Uh, Berserker. Berserker G. G. Uh, Genki desu ka? Let's see. Berserker G. 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 Wa. Hey, Kino. Benkyo wa. Do desu ka? Uh. My study's doing well. Uh, going through words one at a time. I, uh, I was t I did a reading on the uses of a comma today as well. Uh, has gotten through some more words. Konnichiwa, Inspector Puppy. Genki desu ka? Yeah, let's see. Usage of a comma, did you say? Yes, I, I, I was talking about the different uses of a comma in Japanese. Oh, I think they're called a doten in, in Japanese. Doten. Let's see, was that the name for them? Uh, just like the maru, or the period. Uh... It seems to have been come came from English. Dalton, um, there's a lot of things called Dalton. See, comma. Let's what to see what this dictionary calls a comma. Oh, here we go. Yes, yeah, a Dalton, a comma. Let's see, what else do they say? What's the difference between... Okay. Skamu is a difficult word. No one uses it because government decided it as a non something joyo kanji oh it's not considered a kanji in common use so hence why people don't use it introduced in 1981 list of 2136 kanji designated for common use Revised in 2010. Let's see, and it's called a Joyo Kanji. So it's not one. Okay, so Skamu is, okay. Hold on. That is the right word, right? Let's see. Oh, no. That's... Wait, that's Skamu as in... Is that a different kanji? Let's see, Skamu. Grip, grab. Oh, okay. It just looks similar to it. Uh, it's pronounced the same as Skamu. And, and it's everything's the same except for this little internal part's been changed. But that word means to seize, to catch, to grasp. Oh, okay. I see. It's just an alternative kanji for it. So, yeah, what I'm looking up is just an alternative kanji for that skamu word. Okay. So, back to their explanation. Let's 
see. We use this Gamu Kanji only. The other one is is the difficult word. Okay, what's the difference between? He hasn't found a Japanese definition for it. Let's see what they say. Interesting. They're translating as grip and grasp. There are words that we can use somewhat like uh, hold your hand or grab your hand. Can you explain the difference? Okay. Uh, let's see. The difference is. So the focus of Nigidu is on the part of the fingers that are being exerted and the object takes an important an important matter. But the focus of Nigidu is on the part of the fingers that are being exerted, okay. On the other hand, the purpose of Skamu puts the bending of the fingers into perspective and focuses on the movement. It takes a person's uh, feelings or the main point of a thing as the object. So examples would include But Nigiru, uh, explanation of grip in detail. I should know this, these words. Uh, oh yeah, kuashi, kuashi kaisetsu, ki kaisetsu explanation, kuashku, yeah, kuashku kaisetsu, detailed explanation. Let's see, Nigi, Nigiru places the point of view on the part putting strength into the fingers. N Nigiru can place four objects. Wait, Nigiru can place four as its objects? What? This is a bad translation. <laughs> Nigiru wa yotsu no mon. Oh, mono. This, okay. Yotsu o mono. Mokuteki go object. Ni. Okay, mas. That doesn't make any sense. Um, oh, I think they're talking about these four examples down here. Okay. Bend, bend all fingers of the hand inward. Also, grasp and hold an object in such a way. 
Tet no Yubi, Zenbu or something. Let's see, to seize a thing, to make its one own, to hold it in your hand, to grasp important things with certainty, to make nigiri meshi, rice balls, or nigiri sushi, or nigiri sushi, or sushi. I'm talking about nigiru here. Hmm. Okay, and in this example, we have Kanojo wa boku no te o sukamimashita. She gripped my hand. So from her, from how I understand it, sukaru is main focused on just doing the action of gripping while uh, nigiru is main focused on like the pressure being exerted from the grip. I think is what they're trying to say. Kanojo ga boku no te o tsukamimashita, tsukamu. Boku te skamimashita, okay, kanojo. See, uh, eru. Kare wa taikin. Kare wa taikin no emashita, yo. Eru, kare wa taikin o emashita yo. Eru, kare wa taikin o emashita yo. So, emashita, taikin, kare. Uh, you bet, you bet. Nagare, okay. Okay, you bet, nagare, boshi o mimashita. You bet, you bet, nagare, boshi o mimashita. You bet. Yeah, this is from, uh, used in Kino, and this is used in, um, Yoru. One of the words, last night, you bet. You bet, nagare, ru. Well, nagare boshi o mimashita. This is used in nagareru, which is to flow, and this is from hoshi or star. So, flowing star, shooting star. So, yube nagare boshi o mimashita. Uh, yo. Yo yu, shupatsu mare, jikan no yo yu ga arimas. Yo yu, shupatsu mare, jikan no yo yu ga arimas. Yo yu, shupatsu mare, jikan no yo yu ga arimas. Arimas, yo yu, jikan, shupatsu. Shupatsu. Skamu, skamu, kanojo ga. Boku no te o tsukamimashita. Tsukamu, kanojo ga boku no te o tsukamimashita. Tsukamu, kanojo ga boku no te o tsukamimashita. Tsukamimashita, te, boku, kanojo. Mote kuru. Uh, uh, Sono isu o motte kite kudasai. Motte kuru. Sono isu o motte kite kudasai. Motte kuru. Sono isu o motte kite kudasai. Motte kite. Isu. This is actually a really good example of te form training. Um. Uh, 
when you see terraform chaining, it either means one happens one after the other, or uh, it means they're happening at the same time. In this case, the act of having something, mote, and the kudu coming, or happening at the same time. So when you have something and you're coming, you're bringing something. So, Shunkan. Sono Shunkan. Okay, Sono Shunkan. Neko ga tobidashimashita. Sono Shunkan. Neko ga tobidashimashita. Shunkan. Sono Shunkan. Neko ga tobidashimashita. Shunkan. Sono Shunkan. Neko ga tobidashimashita. Dashimashita, Tobi Neko Shunkan. Sono Shunkan Neko ga Tobi Dashimashita. Kehai, Kehai, Kare, Tomorachin, Kare, Tomorachin no a Iken o Kehai shita. Hite, Kare, Tomorachin no Iken o Hite shita. Okay, Hite, so what is Kehai then? Kehai. Oh, indication, sign, hint, sensation, feeling. This is hitei. This has means basically negative something, and this means sort of like an agree agreement or acceptance. So, no acceptance or denial, negation. Hitei. Kare, tomorachi no ike no hitei shita. Hitei Iken Tomodachi Kare Hitei Hitei Jokyo, let's see, kare wa totemo jokyo ga I don't think this, no, this is not jokyo, this is kare wa totemo something ga Jokyo Maybe jokyo uh, Kare wa totemo jōhyō ga Suta Hyōjō Kare wa totemo hyōjō ga yutaka desu ne Hyōjō 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 I believe this has to deal with Emotions Yes, feeling emotions This has to do with surface, surface table chart diagram. Okay, so basically, the surface of an emotion is an expression, essentially. So hyojo, kare wa totemo hyojo ga yutaka desu ne. This is abundant. Kare wa totemo hyojo ga yutaka desu ne. Kare wa totemo hyojo ga yutaka desu ne. He's very expressive. Or in other words. There's an abundant expression, a very abundant expression.
abundant, plentiful, rich, ample. Hite kare tomorachi no iken o hite shita. Hite kare tomorachi no iken o hite shita. Hite kare tomorachi no iken o hite shita. Hite iken tomorachi kare hite shita. Kare, Tomodachi no Iken o Hiteshta. So, uh, tabe, uh, tabe sugi, oh, tabe sugi te, uh, onaka ga something. I assume that's a word for full, because this is, it says eating too much, stomach is something, or it could be, in, hmm. Kurushi, Tabesugite, Onakaga Kurushi. Kurushi, painful, just difficult. Tabesugite, Tabesugite, Ah, Tabesugite, Onakaga Kurushi. I've eaten too much and my stomach hurts. Is there a difference between kurushi and itai then? Kurushi versus itai grammar. Kurushi and itai, what's the difference? Okay. Itai is physically pain, as you know, and kurushi is, oh, it's difficult to explain. It's an adjective to show to have difficulty. For instance, if you have, if you had difficulty to breathe, you would say kurushi. If you, if you wore a bit smaller cl cloth and felt some pressure on your stomach, you would use a kurushi. In other words, if you felt something uncomfortable, it would be the time to use kurushi. Okay, so it has a connotation of being difficult or uh, uncomfortable. But uh, it seems to be used in the physical sense, so it's... Kurushi. Tabe sugi te onaka ga kurushi. I've eaten too much, my stomach hurts. Okay, so I, I got. I'm, I'm guessing they're using kurushi. To, they're not trying to say that this is like a strong pain. This is like. It kind of hurts, like, but bordering more on the uncomfortable side kind of pain. Tabe sugite okina ga kurushi. Kurushi okina tabe sugite.
表情。彼はとても表情が豊かですね。豊か。表情。彼。表情。彼はとても表情が豊かですね。彼はとても表情が豊かですね。豊か。表情。彼。我慢会社で私我慢を私会社で我慢なことを起こったの ?Okay, no, I don't I think this is supposed to be m i n d o not 我慢会社で m i n d o なことが起こったの m i n d o 会社で面倒なことが起こったの。面倒。会社で面倒なことが起こったの。起こった。面倒。会社。会社で面倒なことが起こったの。会社で面倒なことが起こったの。面倒。That's it. g o m e on was. To bear with, I believe. Yeah, endure patience, bearing with. Mendo. See, and the kanji for Mendo has to deal with surface mass features and. Uh, let's see. Taoreru or Taosu. Knock over. So, on the surface, something being being、uh, knocked over, which is, I guess, metaphoric for like having trouble, so troublesome. Mendo. Kaisa de Mendo na koto ga okota no. Kurushi. Tabe sugi te. Onaka ga kurushi. Kurushi. 食べすぎてお腹が苦しい。苦しい。食べすぎてお腹が苦しい。苦しい。お腹あ、食べすぎて。あ、女性。そのパーティーに女性は何人来ますか女性、そのパーティーに女性は何人来ますか女性、そのパーティーに女性は何人来ますか何人、女性、パーティー。女性、ようやく、ようやく、ゴールが、見えてきました。ようやく、ようやくゴールが見えてきました。In other words, at last I was able to see the goal coming. ようやく、ようやくゴールが見えてきました。Or at last we could see the goal. ようやく、ようやく、ゴールが見えてきました。So what was the origin of ようやく、ようやく、adverb。See what does ようやく make? See, approximately translation misfortune bad luck to be jealous of, to be envious of, to envy.
。そう。ようやく、ようやくゴールが見えてきました。見えてゴール、ようやく。たたく。彼は子供、彼は子供のお尻を叩いた。お尻、お尻。彼は子供のお尻を。お、maybe this is he く彼は子供のお尻を響いた足。叩く。彼は子供のお尻を叩いた。お尻を叩く。Okay, so. Tap it. So, 彼は子供のお尻を叩いた。He slapped his child on the bottom. See, お尻。お尻。Okay, bottom buttocks. Kare wa kodomo no o s h i r i o t a t a i t a たたいたお尻、子供、彼。命令、彼女は命令に。知ったはなかった。That's that, that was, let's see, that was Shita. Oh, yeah, Shita ga, gao. Yeah, Shita gao. So Shita ga, Shita ga, what? Shita ga, wana kata. Kanojo wa, mele ni, Shita ga, wana kata. See, that was. 命令。彼女は命令に従わなかった。命令。彼女は命令に従わなかった。従わなかった。命令。彼女。彼女は命令に従わなかった。彼女は命令に従わなかった。運ぶこの荷物を一緒に運んでください。運ぶこの荷物を一緒に運んでください。運ぶこの荷物を一緒に運んでください。運んで一緒荷物。運ぶ。Please carry this luggage along as well. Or two. Please carry this luggage along too. いたす。私からご連絡いたし、いたします。わた、私からご連絡いたします。いたす。私からご連絡いたします。いたす。私からご連絡いたします。いたします。ご連絡。私。彼は結果に親族の満足の、yeah, 満足彼は結果に彼は結果に満足したようです満足彼は結果に満足したようです満足彼は結果に満足したようです。満足、満足、結果、彼、満足した。
苦しい。食べすぎて、食べすぎて大きなが苦しい。苦しい。食べすぎてお腹が苦しい。苦しい。食べすぎてお腹が苦しい。苦しいお腹食べすぎて。たたく、彼は子供のお尻をたたいた。たたく、彼は子供のお尻をたたいた。たたく、彼は子供のお尻をたたいた。たたいた、お尻、子供、彼。Um, その男は彼女のその男は彼女のバッグを,を奪うあ、それ、奪うその男は彼女のバッグを奪ったぞ奪うその男は彼女のバッグを奪ったぞ奪うその男は彼女のバグを奪ったぞ。奪ったバグ彼女男。奪う。奪う。奪う。もっと、あの人は、あ、卓球の。もっと選手、選手です。あの人は、卓球のもっと選手です。もっと、あの人は、卓球のもっと選手です。もっと、あの人は、卓球のもっと選手です。選手、もっと、卓球、人。傷。この傷はすぐ良くなるでしょう。傷。この傷はすぐ良くなるでしょう。傷。この傷はすぐ良くなるでしょう。なる、良く、すぐ、傷。そんなことは絶対でき,、ね、できないよ。絶対。そんなことは絶対できないよ。絶対。そんなことは絶対できないよ。絶対。そんなことは絶対できないよ。絶対。こと、そんな。See, and this comes from. Let's see, compare anti versus equal, even opposite. And let's see, discontinue, sever, cut off, interrupt, suppress, be beyond, without match. Z Thai absolutely unconditional. So if you're not without match, then it's absolutely, I guess. It's like sort of using like a double negative here. Z Thai. そんなことは絶対できないよ。そんなことは絶対できないよ。思う。この
この料理は主が薄い味この料理は味が薄い、oh, 味 is omo a word omo chief main principal important main secondary supporting role in kyogen this is aji この料理は味が薄い。薄い味。料理。お、ち、驚くような。something が目に入った。入った。Say, say, no, say, call satisfaction. Um, Koke, Odorokuyona, Koke, got many hyped up. Koke, Odorokuyona, Koke, got hyped, Odorokuyona, Koke, got many hyped up. Wait, I happen to see an astounding sight. I know this is sight, and this is happen to see part. I mean, this is an astounding part, but where's the happen to see? See, many haita. That just means to see something, I thought. Many haita. コーケーがコーケー The sight caught my eye. I saw a sight. I saw the scene. 驚くような I saw an amazing sight. Okay, there's no mention of happen to it. Must ask about that. Why is it saying I happen to? おどろくような傾向の光景光景が目に入った Where does the happen to see come from? So, Odoroku yona, Koke ga me ni haita. Haita me koke. See, so this K comes from scenery, and then this comes from light, hikari. So, light and scenery makes a sight.
おじ。この料理はおじがうつい。味。この料理は味が薄い。Oh, 味。味。味。Okay. この料理は味がうつい。うつい。味。料理。質問がありますか Are there any questions? There's no questions, then we're just going to raid, so please stick around for that. Okay, so who's studying Japanese right now? Why is someone studying Japanese? Okay, so we're going to raid.、Uh... Yo, Zora, Dark Knight. Ah,、uh, Mina san, okay, o t s k i t e Mata, Ashta. Goodbye, everyone. See you tomorrow.